Hello and welcome to the tutorial course for Strategy Quant's Ear Wizard. My name is Tom Juhas. The Ear Wizard is a powerful tool that gives a simple trader everything he needs to automate his trading strategies without any programming background. You won't need to write long lines of codes, the program itself will write it for you. However, you will gonna have to set those rules according to the Ear Wizard's unique structure and that can be more difficult as it appears first. The simple reason is that the creators really thought about every option you might want to have in your experts, and with such a lot of possibilities at first many get lost and disencouraged. That is why this tutorial was made and by the end of it you will be in a place where you are comfortable with every features of the program, where you can solve the most complex issues and work much more efficiently. And Ultimately, I want you to be fully able to start creating experts on your own. To get there, this is how we will go. There are four main sections covering all important features and options of the program. First, we will start with the strategy tab and uh, get to know the basic structure of the program. This section will all about efficiency by using examples and presets, where and how to save your work and a lot more. In this section we will learn about the strategy tab as well, discovering the variable types and what they are good for, and also look at the money management options and features of the program. In the end I will give you an example, we will make a quick setup that you can use every time you start your work. Then we will start exploring the core of the program, the trading rules tab. We'll start with the dance section first simply because it's less complex and as a trader you mostly have done those commands manually so they are all familiar. First we will look at the rule order and the structure, how these are executed by the ear wizard. And after we will go through all of the features, first the orders and then the close options and some order management features you can find there and at last but not at least we will look at the assign variable features which is one of the most important feature this program has there are really many many options and things you can do with this after that we start going through the if part with all the possible rule options you have there obviously this will be the longest and most complex part but i will try to give you examples of uh, usage for each after looking at how your rules are measured and executed, we will go through all the main categories with the most common combinations and when we are done, you will have all you need to start working. However, after reading the forum, I decided to add one more section where we will look at the most common roadblocks you usually encounter while creating your expert. This is what gives people the most frustration when they are finished with their rule set but in the test nothing seems to work as it should. The four most common symptoms are when simply your orders don't appear or they do but they are immediately deleted. It is also common to get wrong sizes or misplaced order for some reason. We will look at each of these with live examples, figuring out where the cause of the problem might be. So, this is how the tutorial looks like. But in order to get you there in the end, we need to establish a common ground. Before you go on with the lectures, I ask you to do a few things for me. First, read through the menu to get a good picture of the program and try all the examples given in the home tab. Also, visiting the Strategy Quant page, you will find some cool step-by-step -step videos. I think one is uh, with a simple moving average cross uh, strategy and there is another with a triple exponential moving average. Now watching these will make everything we discuss rather familiar, so I really recommend you to do so. And finally, there is one more thing. I won't have time to explain basic concepts about trading, for I expect you to already have a rather intermediate knowledge about it, which is necessary if you want to create your own stuff later. So, if any time you feel to get lost, check some of the free sources on the net like Babypips or Investopedia to expand your knowledge. You don't have to know, of course, every indicator MetaTrader 4 has to offer. On that I will show you a couple of sites you can use when we are there. So, if you are ready, have fun, try everything out 
and don't hesitate to leave your feedbacks, comments or advices here or on the Strategic Quant Forum.